You might want to get the kids out of the room. I might get out of control on this one. I am really hot. Okay, uh, this concerns controversy between Donald Trump and Megyn Kelly. I'm going to make, uh, huh. you're going to hear from me, Megyn, and Fox News, too. You disgust me. Apparently Kelly has struck a nerve. In case you don't know, uh, the first thing she goes and asks Trump is at the so-called Republican debates, even known to uh, call women who um, talk, who you disagree with, call them ugly, fat, disgusting pigs or something like that. She goes on and on. Uh, that was a personal attack. Excuse me, but it's unprofessional in the extreme. You disgust me, madam. I'll be honest with you, uh, uh, Megan. I would have walked out. I would have said, okay, I'm here to talk about po presidential politics, what I would do what my agenda is. I'm not here to talk about personal things. You are out of line, madam. A presidential debate is not a mandatory part of running for president. And I would have walked out. That's what all the candidates should have done. Now you, madam, your behavior was disgusting, as far as I'm concerned, and I'm not taking that back. I kind of wish that, like I said, all the candidates just said, okay, we're not going to tolerate personal attacks by you, and they should have all walked out. Maybe that would have taught you a lesson. You, madam, do not deserve to call yourself a journalist, despite what uh, this article says. Shortly before the show aired, their boss, Roger Ailes, issued a statement of support saying Donald Trump and I spoke today. We discussed our concerns, and again, I expressed my confidence in Megyn Kelly nationally. She's a brilliant journalist. No, she's not. And I support her 100%. I assured him that we will continue to cover this campaign with fairness and balance. Well, that's out the door. We had a blunt but cordial conversation on, and the air has been cleared. You may have heard that there's dust up involving yours truly and presidential contender Donald Trump, Kelly said on her show tonight. She said she had decided not to respond to Trump's comment, adding that he has decided to decline to apologize, and I certainly am not apologize for doing good journalism. Well, when you do some good journalism, then we can talk about that. But frankly, ma'am, I don't think you're capable of it. You are an unprofessional. Your behavior at the debates was grossly, grossly unprofessional. You should never have ever tried to bring up personal stuff. It's about politics, plain and simple. I would have walked out. I'm sorry. Fox News, you can go fuck yourselves as far as I'm concerned. I don't watch... I don't turn on TV and watch ABC, NBC, CBS either. They're bad enough, but this just takes a prize. I mean... Anyone who doesn't know that 6.30 news at night isn't done in a studio, uh, it's a pre-packaged uh, entertainment package, I got news for you. You uh, are out of touch. If you don't know, these are basically entertainers rather than uh, news people. I got uh, Bridge in Brooklyn to sell you dirt cheap, 50 bucks. 
These are entertainers. They're not news people. They don't give a rats. They don't give a rat fuck about uh, the news. They care about entertaining and they care about ratings. But this just took the prize. It got me. It tripped me right off. Megan Kelly, as far as I'm concerned, you should have been fired on the spot. And I wish the candidates would have simply walked out on you. I would have walked out. I would have said, I don't need this. I'm not answering your questions. You're unprofessional. And I would have walked out. What are you going to do about it? Nothing. Totally disgusting. He should have never said what he said. She had blood coming out of her eyes or whatever. He should have never said that. He should have just walked out. I would have said, you're an unprofessional. You don't deserve to call yourself a journalist. I'm out of here. At least that's what I say. You don't deserve to call yourself a journalist, man. You disgust me. You know, for the good old days when people had integrity and just walked out on people like you. I want to thank some Mars. Uh, God help this country.